Arada, parada, e ó, bebê, o rádio. Ei, é, é, é. Esse é o que eu faço, meu bebê. Se você não se me conhece, você vai me roubar. Ei, ó, cansem. Yeah, good rap, ó, cansem. Yanko, ei, ei, ei. Você tem que ser. Só uma família de homem. A dana, o tatame. O de mami, via, não, o de a coma, quame. Mami, ni sua tatame. Só uma família de homem, mami, co. No bifo, fro, tatame. Who jam me on the one crime? Yeah, baby girl, make you not try me. Yeah, no try. I never thought I was gonna be on this wave, cause I was ready to take a couple things to my grave. First off, let it clap for you, baby, you brave. But you can't pick and choose what to say, please behave. Or be on some house or him if you wanna talk. You gotta tell the world if you got a nigga, you fuck. You can't just be the victim and pick a picture like you were just looking for love. I'm all the dicks that you suck. Hey, I'm not gonna sit here and lie hey, behind hey, the fence. Do hey, hey. let's continue. Now me fist a voice, I clock it with the baddest bitch That's a sign of your united since I saw say Cuban links I was trying to stay away from you but then you came What you said when you man, I'm the one to be blamed Okay, of course I thought that you were trying to start another drama I'll be boy from the streets, I know the game Yes, I wasn't ready but then I told you to keep it What you said was cool, I woke up, you gotta complete it To be very honest, till today I don't believe it Cause me casa me, I'm a doctor, America, you say you don't need it After conversation, I then you sent me a text Said what I'm for me, what don't pay me, but you know he's the best So don't you make it seem like I was the one pushing you for abortion Cause that be the only part to make a fence Yeah, some of them in the jam I don't know what that tell me What the mommy here and I would hear come up for me Mommy needs to attack to me So one family I'm in the jam and mommy go Don't be for fraud that tell me Who jam and honey? Pick one Oh baby, you can't send me a break You know recently Von Nelson brought out a book And she calls it I'm not even Nelson in the book She narrates her story How she was born How she was raised How uh, she Her life Life Her career life And in the Book one of the major talking points was she having an affair with Sarkodie, getting pregnant for Sarkodie, and apparently Sarkodie refusing to accept the baby. So, Yvonne Nelson having to abort the baby, which makes it look like Sarkodie gave her pressure or gave her the, gave her the idea to abort the baby because she didn't have any option. Now, it is good that Sarkodie has replied. A lot of people are saying that it is not necessary, but I think it is necessary Sarkodie reply. It's necessary we hear Sarkodie's side of the story because every queen has two sides. Now, if Sarkodie should have kept quiet over this, this will be haunting him. So anytime he goes for an interview, he knows that will be a gray and an uncomfortable area when it comes up. So it's good Sarkodie has replied. Now, this is what Sarkodie says in the song as part of his story. I love the song, I love the beat, I love the rhythm. I tried to put some analysis one or two to it. Now, at the end of the day, we are going to listen to what Sarkodie has said compared to what Yvonne Nelson said, and we will know who is telling the truth because Michelle said intellectual analysis in the Ahane Yeno. We were not there, but based on what they've said and based on current events, we will be able to know who is telling the truth or who is lying. So stay with me, let's go, Yanko, Yanko, let's take it from the top. So I won't me Jami, Yanko. Pa 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 da This is a great rap song. I got the idea. Someone play me the jam. I don't know what that tell me. What the mommy be and I would hear come upon me. Mommy need to attack to me. Someone play me the jam and the mommy go. Don't be for fraud that tell me. Who jam on a one crime? Yeah, baby girl, make it so done. This one, I call the insane straight. Say, hey, Yvonne Nelson, those times, you know, and even up to now, Princess Tyra. What I say? Oh, I mean, you are all over the place. And even in the book of Yvonne Nelson, in the book, I am not Yvonne Nelson, which is an interesting read. I said, find time and read a beautiful book, beautiful piece of work. When you read the book, you realize that Yvonne Nelson says that when she started acting and when she was in Central University, she was all over the place. Everybody was running after her. She was getting juicy offers from producers, directors, all over the place. That was when she brought the movie Princess. In that movie, she was the main character, Princess Tyra. So this is what also, uh, Cordia is saying. All right, let's listen to what he says. Be on his wave because I was ready to take a couple things to my grave. First off, let me clap for you, baby. You brave, but you can't. Well, Akodia is saying that first of all, he didn't even want to talk about this, but it's a brief step, a brief step Ivor Nelson has taken. And since Ivor Nelson has decided to talk about it, then Akodia to also have to respond, which I agree with him. Yanko, Akodia Yanko. First off, let me clap for you, baby. You brave, but you can't pick and choose what to say. Please behave. Or be on some house or him if you want to talk. You best punch, like you can't pick 
and choose. And that's what a lot of people are saying. And I think I agree. If you are saying the truth, you have to say the whole truth, nothing but the truth. And you have to say it all. Young call, call the be on some also with him I if you wanna talk You gotta tell the water big out the nigga you fuck You can't just play the victim and paint a picture like you were just looking for love I'm all the dicks that you suck I'm hey, not gonna hey, sit no, here no, no, This is a beautiful song but Cody you can't insult a lady I always tell you this you can you can make your point without insulting Now if you do this you are painting a picture who truly you are and how you related to this lady and it's not the best say kawasem Jai insult no it's not good about an I be that day no you don't insult her it's wrong Yanko I had a hint. Come if it's a voice, I clock it with the baddest bitch. That's a sign of your nice. I'm so sick, you ban links. I was trying to stay away from you, but then you came. What's your message when you mean I'm the one to be blamed? Okay, of course, I thought that you were trying to start another drama. I'll be boy from the street, I know the game. Yes, I wasn't ready, but then I told you to keep it. What's your message with school? I woke up, you gotta complete it. So this, to be very honest, till today, I don't believe the bone of contention. Okoye says that, yes, he told me that you were pregnant. I was not ready, but I asked you to keep it. And first of all, he was even saying that he thought he was the only one. But when he looked at your movement and all that, he realized that there were a lot of men. And even in your book, you've attested to the fact that a lot of men were chasing you. Whether you agreed or not, it's a different matter. And if you agreed and you did a lot of things with people, I'm not sure you put it in the public domain. This is what Okodia is also saying. But you know, a lot of men, after having an affair with a woman, one of the reasons they give they want to leave the woman is that a lot of people are chasing the woman and the woman is unfaithful. How Obidu was able to prove that, that one, I don't know. He leaves it out of his rap. So we cannot believe Obidu for his word. All right, let's continue. But then I told you to keep it. What you ever said was cool. I woke up, you gotta complete it. To be very honest, today I don't believe it. Cause me, cause I'm a doctor, my you say you don't need it. After conversation, now that you sent me a text, so I down for me what doctor be, but you know he's the best. So don't you make it seem like I was the one pushing you for abortion, cause that be the only part we make a vet. Yeah, someone pay me the adjournment. So this is the bone of contention, and this will be my analysis on this one the rest we listen to the song now Kodia is also saying that hey i was not ready but i didn't ask you to abort it i asked you to keep the baby and first of all i didn't believe it and when i asked that my daughter should come my doctor should come and take care of you you said you had your own daughter now people are saying that will be the other age he cannot get his own daughter and uh, we all have he cannot get his own doctor we all have friends who may who have become doctors now and they can become our personal doctors not at any special fee just because of the relationship we have with them probably this is because of that she he was not sure yes of course but he's also saying that he asked you to keep it but it was your decision now in the book of yvonne yvonne partially takes the blame and also put the blame on sarah there if you ask me the person who decides to give birth is the woman a man can give a woman a reason to give birth or not to give birth or not to give birth the one who finally decides to give birth is a woman there is a special reason why even though a woman brings an egg and a man brings a seed god has made a woman the custodian of the pregnancy it is the woman who carries it now if a woman wants to give birth for you she can decide to to ignore whatever you say even if you ask her to take medicine she can say no and what can you do you can't force her to take her to a, a hospital to remove it no it's a decision of a woman to keep a baby. But if a woman doesn't want to keep a baby, she can even decide to drink medicine just after the sex. And even when she's pregnant, she can decide to even drink medicine with your knowledge or without your knowledge. She can always go to a doctor with your knowledge or without your knowledge. So for me, if Yvonne Nelson should have kept them the pregnancy, whilst Sir Akodia was saying that he was not going to take it, and if Yvonne Nelson gives birth, then we can blame Sir Akodia that, hey, the lady wanted to keep it, but you, you are very irresponsible. But as I now, if you are not seeing yourself, you've given a lot of reasons why you couldn't have kept the pregnancy. In your book, you even said one of the reasons was that you were in your first year at the university. And anyone who has read the book will attest to the fact that you said that you struggled to go to the university because you didn't write two papers, which was costing an accountant. So it cost you even your crown, which was the Miss Ghana. So when you had opportunity to go to the school again, there was nothing that you were going to allow come between you and the school. You mentioned it. These are things that we put together to know who is saying the truth and who is not saying the truth. Because you, you mentioned it. You said that you took your school very seriously to the standard. In your final year, you had, to ha you had an issue with Frank Raja, who was the producer who first introduced you to movie and brought you to the limelight because you were on set. 
and they were not shooting the movie and they were delaying and all that and it was affecting your school and you repeated that you were not willing to let anything separate your school so it is clear even Nelson that you were clear that you were not going to allow anything to separate your school and this is what Sakwa is saying that you said that you were in your final year and you wanted to complete your school and you yourself in your book you had, you had said that you were in your final year they had also banned you and you didn't know what to become of the child and you were not sure so yes of course Let's even assume without admitting that Sarkozy even said, don't keep it. If a woman wanted to keep it, and if Yvonne you wanted to keep it, like Nana Ban Amor and all those people who have kept, I'm not saying that men should not be responsible, but I'm saying that the final decision as to whether a woman will give birth or not solely lies or finally lies in the hands of the woman. A man can give a woman a reason to give birth or not to give birth, but the final decision always lies in the hands of the woman. And this one, it is clear that as at that time, you were not seeing your band, and as at that time, you were in your final year, and as at that time, you also said, I'll be this career, you didn't know the left from the right, so you were not sure. So, even if I'll be the said, go and remove it, it was because you yourself, you had made up your mind, you easily accepted it. If you didn't want to, by now, I'm sure the baby, but hey, I'm not here to blame anybody, and I'm not here to sit on the high mountain of righteousness or not we are just analyzing the data all might be blamed but majority of the blame if you ask me even it goes to you based on the chronological unfolding of events and what we have heard so far all right let's continue Sack, let's continue let's continue and for me, I'll believe those times Simone also was Princess Tyra. And she had even mentioned it in her book. And look at how she even lifts, lifts that period of her time. How she was all over the place. How she gets offer from people, people giving her money and all that. And she says that she didn't accept, she didn't do any of them. That's fine. But trust me, if she did most of them, she wouldn't review it. So that's what he's saying. You understand? A lot of pressure was on you, Ivan Nelson. What I said, this own penalty, I'm an uncompatriotic. Then to us. Two weeks ago, you tried to set me up and get a pain. But me, knowing you, I kind of knew that you were really after something. So I said that we should meet so you explain. Big RG meeting was sky bar. What's the one the door? So I'm like, ah. And then you told me, I'm in Sandra with you, and I'm missing me. I'm missing me, I'm with them, you like bad. You're what kind of pen or show, so so. He talks about rhyming, sky bar. Ah, I'm missing me, with them, you like bad. You're what kind of show, so so. He means I'm bad with you, no, so. This is a mark of a good rapper. He's saying a story, but he's able to put it in a good rap. He's getting the rhyme screen, the rhyme schemes right, and everything right. The beat, perfect. Good rap. Yanko. And then you're saying, I'm your baby. Baby girl, make it no try me. Few weeks ago, you tried to set me up again. Oh, shut up, try my WhatsApp, so you still go through the pain. But me, knowing you, I kind of knew that you were really up to something. So I said that we should meet, so you explain. Big RG meeting was sky bar. What's the one on the door? So I'm like, ah. And then you told me, second, I miss Amra with you, and I miss me. I miss Amisha with them, you like bad. Near what kind of pen or show song song? Miss Amra with fear, be a man, I don't know song. And then you are saying, ah, near bar, be KBI, and be JD. Be man, I be no me drain, yo. We know what it is, show the shit's in the bag. Cause after we're done, bring the happiness back. Take the blame, cause nobody gets the cost of a bad choice in life. Stop the personal attacks. First few hours. This is very, very important. He says that stop giving people the blame and stop attacking people. Accept the decisions you make, you made, and take responsibilities for them. When you read the book, you realize that Ivan Nelson blames everybody. Her mom, everybody, people in the industry blames Ghana, Ghana, our history, black race, and everybody. Not just Sakodi alone. And makes it look like it's a man's word and all that. So she clearly <laughs> is blaming almost everybody. And Sakodi is saying, hey, hey, girl, Charlie, <laughs> look at the decisions you're taking. And be responsible for your own decision. I think it's a good advice. Yeah, yeah, it's a good advice. The only people you you saw her praise was her nanny, the one who took care of her baby, who was formerly her shop attendant, and Majid, Michelle, Jackie Apia, and some few actresses, Genevieve, and the rest. But from that, she attacks everybody. And she also praises her school. And she even attacks 
and secondary school agri memorial she even attacks the judges at, at miss ghana and the miss ghana judges and say that because she was not having you know she was not in the university or so please please you want us to beg you beg you Everybody can tell so it's not because the book is really good but we're living in a world where negativity sells i pray you get the healing that you need maybe claim me good girl you are for the streets strategy not hate your head my you too me i'm just one cup of shop i'm about to read someone pay me the ajami i don't know what that tell me what they mommy be and i would they come up me mommy this what that tell me someone pay me the ajami the jami mommy go no be for fraud that tell me who jami on the one grab me baby girl make you not try me make you not try me Hey yo people, so that is it. He calls this try me raw. So I'll be there. I'm gonna rob. I'll be there. The insult is not good. You can make your point, like I'm saying, you can't insult a lady. You cannot say that she's for for the script and all that. If you can't use those words for crazy, you can't use it for another woman respectfully. Even if she insults you, she has done wrong. But you cannot also be sent and that level and insult. Her. No, you can't do that. A woman that you've done something with before, you can't disrespect her. The way you are going, I'm not crazy because you've married her and you don't know how to disrespect her. And, then, you know, you can't do that. and we were not there, and we didn't know how you treated her. But the way you are even treating her on this song, the words you are using on her, it's also a true reflection of how you treated her. her. And that's what will be the case. I thank you. Now it's good you've come out, guys. This is my view. Let me also know what you think on the comment section. This is Justice MS. It's been a while, and this topic was something that we needed to. Express an opinion on it. Get Ivan Nelson who says I'm not Ivan Nelson. It's a very beautiful thing. For now, with your kind permission, I am out. But anytime you see a prayer, make sure you say one for justice. MSC. Yeah, yeah. Hit on the subscribe button, like it, share, and all that. Very, very important. But for now, with your kind permission, I am out. But before I go, I took one. I've seen Ivan Nelson tweeting. Let me look at what she tweeted and quickly comment on it. Uh, she, she said, in my book, that was after Safa Dear Brother's song, Ivan Nelson tweeted. He said that in my book, I narrated how you got me pregnant, how you couldn't wait for me to get rid of it, how you drove me to have an abortion as usual. You want to use rap to rubbish a pain a young girl felt. She's taking it, she's trying to push the agenda agenda. And she goes ahead and she says that we both have daughters. Let's see what life throws at them. The name said if she's trying to test a video or whatever. And then she goes ahead. Insults won't work, Michael. That is our father's name. Respect womanhood. I'm happy the world gets to see how you are playing this and the role you. Young women get to learn from this. You could be you could get the applause for the rap still doesn't change the truth then zara felix says that even nelson his back as a father the fierce was nigga says that after luring a 22 year old into having unprotected sex with you you're still playing the victim card so i think if you is supporting sarah kodia and blaming even nelson because at that time even nelson was 25 sarah kodia was 22 let me know what you think. Like I said, if you say a prayer, she will say one for justice and mercy. But for now, it's your time to make sure. I'm out. We are doing this. That's how I am. Don't be for fraud that time. Who jam me on the one crime? Yeah. Baby girl, make it no try me. Yeah, no try me. I never thought I was going to be on this wave because I was ready to take a couple things to my grave. First off, let me clap for you, baby. You brave. But you can't pick and choose what to say. Please behave. Well, be honest, so I'll hear my if you want to talk. You got to tell the world if you got the nigga you fuck. You can't just be the victim and pay the picture.